Really? Now that we know the name, all we need is an address. You're right. We'll succeed if we all do it together. Sis has yet to say anything, but I believe she's looking into possible actions as well. As for me, I will look into every viable solution. Thanks. Make sure you give my regards to Shiho-san. Oh, could we try getting their help as well? I'm sure they would gladly cooperate. That would be a great help. I'll leave that to you. Mm -hmm. We'll talk again tomorrow. Let's save him. No matter what. I'll announce his name as the key figure in the completion of the medicine at the next conference. I've heard that Miwa-chan's progress is going well. Indeed that's true, but... I'm certain that this will help prove his good character in the trials. Please. I want to increase his chances of being found innocent as much as possible. I see. So that's why. You'll cooperate too, right? Lesser. I like to kill him. And so we need to release an official opinion from this school to object his arrest to the police. Good. You'll all agree with me, correct? Hey, I'm a good student. What good are teachers if they don't believe in their students? Please, I, I beg of you, please help me collect enough signatures. Oh, I want to help a friend who's innocent. Aww. He's a really good guy. He always fights for the sake of others. He's... he's my best friend! A certain young man is faced with a dilemma due to the unjust oppression by the government. He is suffering from a crime he did not commit. He is a promising young man who will support this country's future. What justice is there in a country without it being able to save such an individual? This cannot be allowed! Look at the guy ranked number one in these rankings. Isn't his score amazing? I really want to go up against him, but I heard he's been arrested for some crime he didn't commit. I can't believe Shinya's doing this. I can't help him out with just myself alone. We need tons more people's voices, like on online forums and getting signatures and stuff. You have to say with me that it makes no sense that he's been arrested when he's done nothing bad. Please, please help him out. Aw, he took his hat off. I should pay. I should be paying attention to this, but I'm really not. You escape the prison of the heart only to be imprisoned in reality. What a most ironic outcome. Your wish for others' happiness prevailed over your own. However, I feel as though all is finally well. In the end, you willingly chose the correct path. Mm -hmm. Most importantly, you never compromised your values for your own well-being. What's the paperwork, Eagle? The final arcana you have acquired is... The world. Oh, hell it yeah. is the power for an individual to stand on their own two feet, swayed by none. But are there that any personas in the world? Or the power? hope shared amongst your friends and yourself to strive towards a better future. With the world, you are no longer without a place to belong, and will never trudge a path alone again. I know it's about the fool's journey. Blah blah blah. Whatever. My own duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. We knew each other for like a month at best. Oh, the bins are. I 
like Lavenza. Lavenza or Philemon? I will beat my Persona 1 and 2 horse with a dead horse with a stick until it becomes alive again. Don't you worry. Hello. Long time no see. We met last on Christmas Eve, right? Uh, it, never mind, it, it's nothing. I have two great pieces of news for you today. Ah. First, we finally managed to prosecute Masayo Shishido. He'll likely be found guilty. I'm grateful for your cooperation with the trial. Your testimony proved to be very useful. To be frank, it seemed almost hopeless at one point. But thanks to the civil protests, some of the more indecisive prosecutors came to our side. It will likely be some more time until the hearing begins, but this is the first step to true change. The only charges right now are for breaking election laws, breaking funding control laws, and bribery. I knew that proving the Metaverse's existence would be difficult, but I still find myself dissatisfied. Shido did admit to all of his crimes, though, including everything you know about. Now for the other piece of good news. As of today, you'll be free to go. I don't trust it. Shido's confession brought light to the truth of your case. We were able to prove your innocence in the original assault charge that led to your arrest. Your sentence will no doubt be rescinded. You're a free man. The others did everything they could for you. Bringing in the woman who was the victim in your case as a witness was the turning point. To think they'd be able to track down someone involved in a case from well over a year ago. That wasn't all. An unbelievable amount of support has come in from various other places as well. Regardless, the righteous phantom thieves are gone. All that remains is for us adults to lead society in the right direction. Then again, I have to wonder if you believe what I say. Not really. We made a deal though. Thank you. Still, I'm glad I was able to save you in court. I've never felt so happy in my entire life. I'm not quite sure how to put it, but saving your future meant more to me than my own career. I feel like you even taught me how to live. That's good. That is very good. <laughs> that's not true. By the way, there's something that's been on my mind. Mm. What did the treasure of my world turn out to be? I suppose it doesn't matter now one way or the other. There is... one more thing. I haven't even told Makoto about this, but I realized something after meeting all of you. My most prized treasure is the justice I use to protect those important to me. Makoto helped show me that as well. Once the Shido case is settled, I'm thinking of quitting my job and becoming a defense lawyer. I wanted to reform the system. But I'll have to leave that to someone else. Going forward, I want to enact justice not for myself, but for the sake of others. <laughs> well then, I need to go submit the paperwork for your release. Your arm's clipping through your jacket. Thank you again for everything you've done. See you later. Bye. Kept me waiting, jeez. To be honest, I didn't really want to come. But Futaba just wouldn't stop bugging me. Anyway, you're a free man now, aren't you? <laughs> and it'd look bad on me if you did something again under my watch. <laughs> All right, let's go home. It's cold, so get in quick. Aww. Sidra so cares about me. God bless. What a good man. It's not moving at all. Due to the railway incident this morning, widespread delays have impacted the various lines and... 
Another accident, huh? <laughs> Reminds me of that day mm. back in April. Remember when we went to introduce you at the school? Mm. <laughs> you never change, huh? Thinking back, that was pretty awful to you. Throwing you in that storage room all by yourself. And again, soon you're gonna be... Made some great friends here. And you better thank them when we get back, alright? Just the important ones. all the important people it has been a while not bad you look fine I'm glad you seem well and the best for last me so we meet again Hello. it's good to see you all right so let's grab a table I gotta head out and grab some groceries I'm sure you guys have plenty to talk about it's Valentine's Day tomorrow. Now we're only missing one last person. A catchy. She texted me a little while ago that she's finished with practice and heading here. God. I'm guessing she'll be here any minute now. No, kick her out. Sorry I'm late. You're not welcome. Senpai! Um, welcome back. You're not welcome. Alright, that's everyone. Come on, Sumire. Take a seat. Man, it went well, yeah? I'm so glad we didn't give up. This was certainly worth the effort. We didn't know what to do once you were gone. But then we realized something. Even if we don't have the metaverse or any other special powers, we can still change reality. If we didn't do that at the very least, we'd be betraying the entire reason we stood up to Maruki. We'll oppose the injustices of this reality with our own strength. That's what we all agreed upon. Ever since then, we've been doing just that. Busting our asses, trying to get you out of the clink. Not just us. Everyone who believed in you joined us. Thanks to that, we've got our leader yeah, back. a small group of people I max my confidant with. What are you talking about? You're the one who took the hit for us. They treated you fine, right? Actually, did you lose some weight? I am a skinny it boy. It would be understandable. I've heard the food in prison is quite foul. So, uh, what did you eat? Was it bugs? Fermented mackerel? Or maybe durian? You're missing the point. Eh, you're gonna get some good food soon enough, though. Boss is out getting stuff for our party right now. Come on, everyone's back together. It's time to celebrate! <laughs> I guess you really were hungry. I was about to blame Ryuji. Oh, and that wasn't you? Oh no, it's Sumire. Sorry about that. Oh, yes. oh it was Sumire. <laughs> Sojiro will be back soon, just to hang in there. Oh yeah! Uh, sorry for not minding my business. Alright. But we heard from boss, you're going back home next month? Yeah. Can't you stay here? Sure we proved you're not guilty, but people are still gonna label you there, aren't they? Ain't it just gonna be uncomfortable going back? I think I have a choice. What's the matter? We were all so excited a moment ago. How about this? If our leader is leaving, the Phantom Thieves are truly disbanding, correct? Today, we can celebrate his release and commemorate the day of our disbandment. <laughs> what kind of commemoration is that? <laughs> I was serious when I said it. It sounds like a good idea to me. I guess you're right. We just gotta double our excitement for today. About that, there's something I need to tell you guys. Right. I've decided to go with him when he leaves. Aww. He's pretty special after all. Can you Plus, stay with her? We need someone there in case he turns back into a delinquent. Please. 
Really? Either way, I want boy. you guys to add my farewell party to the one we're having tonight. I don't know. Is that important? You're not leaving for another month, right? It is far too early for a farewell party. That'll just muddy the purpose of this celebration. <gasps> oh, how dare you! Sumire, at least you're on my side, right? Uh, me? Then, what say we call this a second round welcoming party? That's the ticket, my re-welcoming party. Nobody can complain about that. So, for the food at my party, <sighs> I demand sushi! Sushi! Man, you guys are loud. I could hear you from outside. Chief, they're so mean. <sighs> Noisy as always. Hey, I'm not some normal cat. I can't understand what you're saying to me, you know. Here. No, I would much rather have sushi than something like... Mm. Huh? This is delicious. What did you give him? <laughs> what an assertive little guy. I wonder where he got that not from. Not me. <laughs> That's just part and parcel of who I am. The one, the only, Morgana. Stop trying to talk so big. You're just a cat now. Shut up. I don't need to hear that from some dumb ape. What was that? It's things like that. You get angry so fast. Oh, and you're vulgar. You little... D why don't you go disappear <sighs> again? Shut up! We're supposed to be celebrating, not fighting! They're at it again. <laughs> you guys never change, do you? <laughs> Seriously, that weirdo Inari. Who are you calling a weirdo? <sighs> don't worry. Being weird is just a sign of your individuality. Uh, you don't need to defend him about that. <laughs> well, anyways, we're all here now. Let's kick this party off! Very well. Sojiro, I want sushi! <sighs> hmm. Delicious food, floppy sheets. I guess home is where you make it, even in this abandoned building of all places. This isn't abandoned. Take care of me like this back home too, okay? But seriously. So I wanted to ask you something. Remember the tail end of Maruki's palace when I was actually flying? That wasn't a dream, right? Sure wasn't. Nice. Yeah, I thought so. I still can't figure out how that was possible in the first place. So this is just a theory, but... Don't you still have that star Jose gave you? Oh! Hey, it's... Lost its luster. It was shining the last time you looked at it, right? So it really was the effect of the star. Well, of course it was, now that I think about it. There's no other way that the idea of a cat converting into a helicopter could suddenly become a common cognition. Well, we're through with the metaverse, and it only happened in the most extreme of emergencies, so I have a feeling that won't be happening again anytime soon. Oh, who's texting me? Takemi? Hey. Are you home? If there's nothing wrong with you, then let me come over and examine you. Just kidding, I wanted to see you. Can I come over after work? Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Best girl. Glad to hear it. You never change, do you? Come on, let's, let's go to bed. You're working at the shop from tomorrow onward, right? I guess. It's Valentine's Day. Never had a Valentine in my life. Right, today's Valentine's Day. No wonder there were so many guys bringing girls in here. Don't you have anything exciting happening? 
I mean, you've been here nearly a whole year. You know, when I was young. <laughs> oh boy. I have a girlfriend. It's the cute doctor. Good evening. <laughs> Should I come <laughs> later? <laughs> the look on his face. Oh, uh, you should have just told me. Here, I'll leave the store to you. I like the Enjoy these yourselves. Heels. Get out of here, Morgana. You seem to be doing well. Sure. It's nice to see you again. You don't look like you've got any issues. That's my line. Suicide in jail, then New Year's in the reformatory? Ex post facto isn't exactly gonna cover this, you know? I don't know what that means. Honestly, can't take my eyes off you for a second, but I guess I'd better get to the point. Wait, oh, Here. Fuck. <gasps> Chocolates. Don't worry, there's nothing too dangerous in them. In moderation, right? That new medicine for that girl I told you about has been working really well. And the day-to-day -day work's going fine. I'm a regular neighborhood doctor now. Thanks. I just hoped you were safe. But looks like you made it home without a scratch. Guess I had nothing to worry about. And if his fight with my therapist, it's fine. She told to Kimmy that I'm going home. Something wrong? Yeah. I see. Can I sit next to you? <sighs> I know that look in your eyes. You've made up your mind. Oh, I am coming back. <laughs> no rush. You can hold off until things settle down a little. But if anything happens, call me. You know how to reach me. By the way, something's different about you. Hasn't been too long since I saw you last, but you've got a little more confidence now or something. Still, I guess I've changed too. As a doctor, I've still got the usual obligations to help my patients, but now I feel like I've got something a little more specific. Like, I could risk it all to make one person happy. But you're a smart guy. I don't have to draw you a picture. <gasps> I was never really into younger guys. It's a good thing I look like an adult then. This relationship completely not legal. Perfect timing. You've got a guest. Oh no. Oh, hi. Sorry to bother you this early in the morning. I was wondering if you'd like this. There's no obligation, of course. What is... What is that? You've helped me through a lot. I wanted to express my appreciation. Sorry for how this is coming off. I didn't mean for it to seem like I'm just dumping my leftovers on you. I'm the one who should be thanking you, so thank you. Well, look at this hotshot. Lucky guy having a gorgeous lady drop by this early just to give you treats. I hope you don't mind that I stopped by today. No doubt you already got some from someone special. I should really be going anyway. Sorry to impose. And this is hardly the end of my debt, of course. Chocolate isn't going to cover all you've done for me. See you around. Speedrun dating sigh. Morning! We usually don't run into each other here, huh? Mm. Oh, yeah. This is for you. What? Why are people giving me chocolate? I was going to give it to you at school, but as long as we're both here, have some chocolate. You know, for Valentine's Day. As friends. Close friends. I'll be counting on you. 
Am I just gonna be going through the day getting chocolate from everyone? Oh, hello. I know it's sudden, but could you watch the store? Yeah. I gotta head out for a bit. Think you can keep an eye on things? I'm a big boy. I can do that. Oh, hello. Oh, were you working? Sorry to distract you. I thought I'd stop by on the way home from work. Partly so I could give you this. What is going on? You've done so much for me, after all. I wanted to say thanks. Oh, and I didn't get to say it at work, but... Welcome back. I'm glad you're safe. Oh, right. I whipped up a little study guide for the classwork you missed. It should cover most of the important stuff. If you're still having trouble with any of it, you can always ask me, okay? I'm your teacher. That's my job. Anyway, I'll see you at school. She's nice. She's a nice lady. Sorry, I keep clicking. I'm scared. The microphone's not doing what it's meant to be. Cat on the windowsill. What is she doing? March. Okay, everyone free after school tomorrow? I should be available. Why? There's something I want to talk about. Thinking we could all meet up at the wall. You can check if boss is free too. Good job. That works for me. Me too. I can head over once school's finished. We're good here too. Likewise, then then let's all head there when we can. Ryuji wants to talk. Did something happen with him? So it's cracking, my guy. Are you sure you want me hanging around? I, I can step out for a bit if you like. No, I'd prefer you stick around. Everyone I owe something to has got to hear this. I'm thinking about moving away. Really? I'm moving? Luigi. It's just... A hell of a lot's happened this past year, you know? It's got me thinking about the future. And how I still want to get back on the track team. That's why I want to move closer to a physical rehab facility. Get my knee fixed up while going to school. At the earliest, all this is going to kick off starting next month. I see. That is quite sudden. Hmm. Um? Actually, I've got some news too. I'm in the middle of looking into studying abroad. Just short term. I've been wondering what would be the smartest move for my career, so... You're moving too? Hmm. Both Haru and I are looking for places to live on our own. Starting next month. In fact, our moves will probably occur around the same time as Ryuji's. I plan to keep learning about the business while also attending college. And that's why Mako-chan and I were talking about how we won't be able to get together like we used to. Are you gonna tell them too? Um, so... I passed the entrance exam. I'm gonna be a high schooler starting in April. <gasps> First high school, then college. Then I can finally research cognitive science for real. Even you, Futaba? No, I apologize. I should be wishing you all the best Yusuke, of luck. Yusuke, you don't even go to nah, the same... you do have a point. High school we are going us. our separate ways. Oh, you mean the bonds we all have? <laughs> That's a great point. It seems you're all taking great strides forward. I, however, will not be going anywhere until I've completed my current painting. No matter how many years it takes, I will express this feeling that's grown within me since we first banded together. That's still some kind of stride, though, ain't it? No matter what we may go through, no, you used to or be how many times we may slump. stumble, we'll follow the path we believe in. That's what the Phantom Thieves are all about. Stop trying to be such a cool cat. I am not a cat! Yeah... I guess I am. There's still no way I'm accepting Doc's reality, but if it weren't for going through that, I don't know if I would have felt this way now. It's like following through with what I want to do in life. I guess I learned how to really believe in my future. In that case, wouldn't you say Sumire learned the same thing? I mean, she is at training camp right now. Indeed. Good riddance. While her viewpoint may differ from the Phantom Thieves' beliefs, there's still much we can learn from her. 
Nor oh, that reminds me. Sumiri left something with me. She told me she forgot to give us this the other day. Is that a newspaper clipping? Guess it was lying on the ground when we got out of Dr. Maruki's palace. This article! It's the case about Dr. Maruki's loved one. The one whose family was murdered. I'd be willing to bet. This is Doc's treasure. So her case was the origin of Maruki's distortion. Mm-hmm. Would you hold on to this? Nope. Falgan with her eyes focused on our dreams. Otherwise, Dr. Maruki's gonna give us all kinds of shit. You're absolutely right. <laughs> well, I'm very impressed. You've all become quite mature. So let me throw you a little celebration in honor of the next chapters of your lives. Order whatever you'd like on me. Thank you. Aww. Oh yeah! It's all you can eat and drink, people! <laughs> Huh? Boss, thank you for the generosity. Oh, no. Uh, th that wasn't what I said. <laughs> Could you at least go easy on me? Everybody <laughs> <did. laughs> right, Whatever you guys want. Woohoo! Hey, oh, great cheese! Grab a Are we sushi? lucky? Sushi! <laughs> <laughs> Is that Ryuji saying sushi? He's texting me. Hello. Sorry for messaging you so late. Just wanted you to send me this picture from our first shrine visit of the year. Who took it? It's cute. It's already March, I can't blame you. I got a lot of mixed feelings about this picture, I guess. That's supposed to be me there, but it just isn't. Yeah. Really makes me realize how buried I was in Kasumi's identity. That's right, I'm not going to run away anymore. Actually, there's one more photo I want you to see. Hmm. It's kind of embarrassing, but this is a photo my coach took of me. The real me, I guess. Training is tough, but it's really hard. And it's really hard sometimes. But I feel like I'm finally moving forward with my life. It's all thanks to you. Oh, my break's over. I have to get back to training. Talk to you later. <sighs> Samiri's standing on her own two feet now. We'll fight for our goals too. Oh yeah. Are you ready for tomorrow? What's happening tomorrow? White day. That's tomorrow, right? What's a white day? You got some chocolates on Valentine's Day, didn't you? And white day's when you return the favor. The men do the gifting. Oh. What's your plan? You've at least got some kind of present ready, right? Nope. Hmm. Get it together, kid. Sometimes I don't know if you're fearless or just plain careless. Fine. Listen up, and I'll give you the recipe for the ultimate date. I'll take notes. Whoa, the chief has an ultimate date plan? I'd better listen in too, just in case. I'll bugger off, Morgana. First off, you're gonna need a gift. This won't work without one. Can't go wrong with flowers. Just make sure you buy them before the date. You gotta present them near the end. Surprise her. So you can't let her see you buying them on the date. Got it? Uh huh. Gotta give them flowers, huh? I gotta take notes. You don't have Next, hands. Think about where you're taking her. You're gonna want somewhere with a right atmosphere, but it's gotta be peaceful. Oh, how about that new aquarium exhibit in Shinagawa? Just saw a commercial for it. Might be a good spot, right? The aquarium's a good place for a date. I see. Now, once the date part's over, you gotta take her out to dinner. Somewhere nice, too. But it's kinda last minute to make reservations. All the fancy places get booked pretty fast around White Day. Okay, right. Too late to make any reservations. Oh, wait, what? Oh, damn it. I don't usually do this, but I know a place. 
<laughs> Can't guarantee anything. I bet they're full up too. But you might get an edge if you mention my name. Wow, amazing! Chief has connections! Mm. So once you're at dinner, you get to talking, enjoying yourselves, and that's when you give it to her. The bill? Whoa, are you sure about that? Absolutely. There's something you gotta give her, and it sure as hell isn't the bill. The flowers, remember? We covered this before. You need that surprise gift. And that ought to do it. Just follow the plan and you're safe. Wow, this plan is foolproof. Leave it to the chief. Well, I taught you my secrets. The rest is on you. Do your prep and make those reservations. Good luck. On that note, I'm going home. Now it's up to you. You should start prepping right away. Don't waste the chief's advice, all right? No, I think I should go to bed. It's getting light. Let's see. The reservation comes first. You remember that restaurant chief told you about? Thank you for calling, sir. Were you looking to make a reservation? I'm sorry, sir, but I'm afraid we're fully booked for tomorrow. White day is crazy, huh? But don't worry. All you have to do is mention the chief. You're a friend of Mr. Sakura's? My apologies, sir. If you could just hold for one moment. Thank you for your patience. You wanted a dinner course for two on the 14th. We will have a table ready for you. Oh, bless. Dang. The chief has serious clout. Could I ask your name and contact information? Okay, your dinner plans are locked in. Now you just gotta get the flowers, and then it's off to the aquarium and dinner. It's gonna be busy tomorrow, so we'd better get rest while we can. I can't believe we played through that. I wonder, it's such a shame we could, there wasn't a way to bungle it. <laughs> Purposefully fuck it up. <laughs> Just for kicks. Today's the day. Let's go get those flowers. I think there was a florist in that underground passage in Shibuya. Where is the flower shop? I literally only go there for fertilizer. I'm looking forward to it. Missed it. Hello. Welcome. Good ones. Understood. I'll get right on that. Here you go. I tried to keep it as simple as possible. The total comes out too. Hold on. Let me cover this one. You've been taking care of me yourself, so I need to express appreciation for you too. Oh God, you're a cat. Ow. Thanks for your purchase. Good luck. Where do you get okay, the money from? Okay, now you're all ready for the date. You know who you plan on inviting, right? Take Don't me. worry, I'm a gentleman who knows his manners. I won't be tagging along. Oh, all right. Thank Christ. Good luck out there. Going to invite. Ah, oh, best girl. What? Something wrong? I need an examination. Shinagawa? Why? Well, I guess that's a stupid question. I'm at work, but I can take off early. I'll see you there. You know, some studies suggested aquariums are good for relieving anxiety. Now that I'm actually in one, I think I get what they're saying. You know what I mean. I'm having a nice time. And having my little guinea pig here definitely doesn't hurt. Never would have guessed I'd be going on aquarium dates at my age. Kind of nice, though. I get that feeling a lot with you. Pretty hard to get used to. Thank you, by the way, for returning the favor in your own way. God, I love a relationship. 
Oh yeah. I'm, so I'm looking forward to it. Let's see if you can surprise me. I think I've seen enough fish for one day. So, what now? Oh really? Then let's see this place. This is a little more than I expected. Use your imagination. <laughs> Sorry. I guess this is the first time I've come here with someone I'm actually into. That answer your question? Just when I think he can't surprise me anymore, my guinea pig somehow keeps outdoing himself. A guy like you is wasted on me, you know. It's a real tragedy. Mm, nah. <laughs> I didn't mean to go fishing for that, but thanks. Sorry, one second. When should I give her the gift? Sorry about that. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us on this special day. We okay. wish you all an unforgettable evening with one last finishing touch from us. Hmm? What's going on? It beats me. Wow. Yeah. What? What a romantic. <laughs> Thank you. A starry cityscape and roses, huh? Don't you think that's a little much? Never enough. Really? Not at all? We can always do more. that sarcasm. That's something I've always liked about you. It's never just about you. You always go to these crazy lengths to make other people happy. I really admire that. People and I guess I've been like... trying to learn from it. Makes me think I gotta work on myself a little before I deserve you. Sweet thing to say. Well, after all this effort, I should at least return the favor somehow. Maybe my guinea pig has a suggestion? Oh, trying to figure out which dog is making noises. Not the one on my bed. <laughs> Hey, I'm finally taking off tomorrow. Mm. So Jiro said you don't have to help out here today. Go and see your friends before you leave. Off you go then. Try not to cry. <laughs> mm, I'm a big boy. I'm sure I'll be fine. I didn't max you out. Even after we're dead and gone, we'll still be the Phantom Thieves, right? Of course. Always. Hey, Sergio. Saying goodbye to me? Cut it out. You're gonna see me tomorrow. Just remember to pack once you get back, you hear? I don't want you forgetting anything important here. That reminds me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. I'm surprised you kept a log this whole time. Thanks, though. I'll keep it safe. Still, a lot has happened. After all, you had quite the side job. Just behave once you're home, okay? Shouldn't you be saying your goodbyes? Go on. Can I? Hey, hey! Okay, where are we going? Or did I? Hey! You look like you're doing well. I decided to stop by after work. I used to come by this area on occasion. I was always a fan of LeBlanc's coffee. It's tomorrow, right? The day you go home? Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. I'm taking you in. On the record, you've been cleared of all the crimes you were accused of. Unfortunately, the stigmas that came with them are a little harder to simply wipe away. You might find that even now, 
Sometimes it'll feel like the whole world's against you. So, just in case, take this. Whenever you need help, I'll be on your side. Remember that. Thanks. I'll be doing my part to bring some real justice to our legal system. Can't rely on the Phantom Thieves forever. Alright. See my girlfriend. Hi. You came. I did. I wanted to update you on Miwa-chan. Her symptoms subsided thanks to the new medicine. She still has some way to go, but it won't be too long until I get to see her smile. Yeah, I'm relieved too. I wouldn't have been able to finish the new medicine without your help. Thank you so much, my little guinea pig. Oh, I guess I can't call you that now that you've helped me so much. Same goes for the situation with Oyamata. You did everything you could to help me with it. I don't know where all that devotion comes from. Maybe I should take a cue from you. Here, I want you to have this. So, here today, gone tomorrow, huh? Yeah. Now, I'm just a neighborhood doctor. No more assistant. Wonder if it's gonna be rough without you. Well, the thought crossed my mind. But somehow, I think we'll be fine. And hey, if I feel like it, I can always surprise you with a house call. Oh, please do. Look after yourself out there, all right? Not just for your own sake. Anyone else? Oh yeah, who's texting me? I just went so rip. <laughs> Buddy. You're heading home tomorrow, I hear. It'll be a new start. You've got my blessing, whatever that's worth. I recall the days when you helped me out with my speeches here. We'll be treading separate paths, but as long as we share a common purpose, I'm sure I'll see you again. If I've earned the support of an upright young man like you, well, that must surely be my greatest achievement. You expect farewells to be so sad, but here we are beaming. From now on, your life is your own to live. Now, I suppose I'd better send you off with a parting gift. It's an incredibly expensive fountain pen I bought back when I'd strayed from the right path. Embarrassingly enough, I hardly used it. I hope you'll put it to better use than I did. Whatever new chapters you write with that pen, I'll be watching for them. I like him. He's nice. Oh, let's... Let's go see what you So, you have come to say farewell. Yeah. I have some words of reflection for you in this time of parting. This twisted, broken world sought to crush you, yet you salvaged it, and with your ideals stitched it whole. You were a true trickster of this modern age, a beloved champion of a burdened public, and a man of such great heights. Well, where will his path take him next, I wonder? Come with me. No, I don't know about that. To accompany a trickster on so twisting and winding a path, I fear I'd soon be outpaced. Please come with me. I have more than mere words to give you today, though. Allow me to grant you a parting gift. Not as the one who leads you, but simply as Lavenza. This is my blessing to you, to carry on your journey. You were confined to yourself for so long. Now at last it seems only right that you bear its key. In the past, guests of the Velvet Room have received their keys upon their very first visits. 
However, I was unable to pass it on to you at that point. This is the least I can do for you now. Thank you. With this key in hand, you will be able to break free of whatever trials may imprison you in the future. Though of course, you have already chosen the path of true freedom. By inspiring others to take up arms and fight for their own beliefs, you may change the world itself. You walk the path of a true trickster. May it lead you to fortune beyond imagining. I love you, Lavenza. You walk the path of a true tr- Alright, I'm just gonna repeat that. Can I say bye to Eagle? Nope. I'm gonna miss you, kid. Yo, man, spring break's supposed to be the most fun part of the year, but instead you're just moving away. You're moving too. Then again, so am I. I guess this is probably the last time we'll be meeting up here. Dude, don't say it like that. You make it sound like I'm gonna die or something. Look, this isn't gonna be the last time we see each other. I'll come visit whenever you want. Honestly, even with the rehab, I don't know if my leg's ever gonna be how it was before. But when I think about how much I want to run, well, I figure there's no point lying to myself. Nothing's guaranteed. I don't know if I'm gonna get anywhere, but well, you could say that for any goal, right? I don't want to live stuck on regrets or shame. I, I'd rather just run and keep on running. And hey, you better practice too. See, if we share our times, we can even compete from far away. And when I think about going to school without you guys, I don't know. I can't imagine it. It's nice feeling like I got a future worth looking forward to for once, though. And it's all thanks to you, man. Mm, I like. I am going to miss Ryuji. Oh, fuck it. Okay, where to next? Coming. Shame about horror. Oh, what a coincidence. I'm about to give a lecture. Did you come to see the campus? You're going back home tomorrow, right? Make sure you keep up your studies there, okay? You are preparing for your entrance exams, after all. Let me know if there's anything you need, okay? This is the last time we'll see each other for a while. You can at least look a little sad about it. I'm kidding. Honestly, seeing you so happy gives me peace of mind. Now that you're heading out into the world, I've got a present for you. It sounds like the setup to a joke. A student bumps into his teacher in a full French maid outfit. But somehow, that opened up all kinds of new paths in my life. You taught me so much. You're not just my best student. You were a great master. I can make up for all the times I distanced myself from my students. I'll help anyone who needs it. The point is, I'll put in the work. I learned a lot from you. And I won't let that go to waste. I still need to speak to Arn and Yusuke. Okay. Completely forgot about them. Hey, Hello. Uh, you're moving tomorrow, right? Don't forget to practice at home! Yeah, whatever happens from now on, I'm gonna keep winning too. If I lose, then I'll deal with it. Just like you taught me. Hmm. Oh right! I returned the money, and he forgave me. We're friends now, and he's even playing gun about with me. He's still a total newbie, so I'm teaching him all the pro strats. Oh, but don't stress. It's not all boot camp this time. I'm going easier on him. 
Thanks for everything. You've helped me so much. I'm gonna give you my secret weapon. See, that's my strategy. I use this to practice at home. But these days, I'm kind of too busy helping Mom or playing with my friends. At first, I thought you were kind of weird, but now, uh, you seem pretty cool. So, thanks. I'm still your teacher when it comes to games, but you're my teacher in real life. Bet are you dreaming? We see the fencer again. I love you. Oh, it's Mishima. Hey, buddy. Oh, so you're finally heading home tomorrow, huh? Totally forgot about Mishima. I guess Mishima. this means the Phantom Thieves have disbanded. My documentary script is going well, though. It's not really close to done, but it's coming along. Wait, we're making this a series? I don't know if it'll be that big of a deal. No, 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 it's called you split it into three parts. Make more money that way. But if I actually get this done, I guess it'd be a waste to stop at one. It makes me wonder how many people I can reach with my work. It's exciting, but kind of scary, too. It might be a bestseller, or it might just fade into obscurity. But I want to put my hope into this. It's a message from the old me to everyone in the world. So, even if I'm scared of failing, I'll face this head on. Oh yeah, it's still a pretty early draft, but... It'd mean a lot if you could read it sometime. I could really use your feedback. You probably had tons of crazy fights I don't even know about, right? So, we should sit down and talk about them sometime. The more of it I get on record, the better. I'll make sure the story of the Phantom Thieves goes down in history. Hey, I'm going to miss you the most. Um... Yeah, it's just Yusuke and on now. That's right. You'll be departing tomorrow. It's sad to see this as a season of farewells, but I didn't expect we'd all go our separate ways. Yes. But I suppose that in itself is a bizarre thought. After all, this time last year we were but strangers. True. Do you remember the painting I submitted to that competition? Desire and hope it was. Well, I would like to bestow it upon you as a parting gift. Aww. As of now, my canvas is still blank. It's not for lack of inspiration. There's so much I want to express, I can barely contain my passion. But my heart has not led me astray yet. I'll paint as it guides me. Even should I scar my work with doubt, hesitation, chaos, Certainly, that's a beauty all its own. Your life is no worse for its own scars. Your truest beauty lies in them. And I hope you tell me their story someday. I'm gonna miss you, Scare, too. Did you come here for souvenirs? This place has everything. Came here to see I'm you. I'm busy getting ready for my study abroad, too. Really? Gotta research schools, places to live. But we're all splitting off to do our own thing, huh? Honestly, it's not really hitting me yet. Yeah, totally. It's not like we're all leaving forever. I mean, we still have the group chat. I'll still be messaging you all. And you gotta respond. By the way, um, a little girl stopped me the other day in Shibuya. Oh? She said she saw me in magazines, and that she wants to be just like me when she grows up. It felt incredible. Oh, right. Vague did a special piece on me in this month's issue. 
Nice. I said it all in the interview, but I'm gonna work hard. One day, I'll be modeling across the world. I've gotta reach people. I wanna give someone hope, like you did for me. Thank you for all you've done. The days I spent with you were some of the brightest in my life. Once I'm a star, I'm gonna shine even brighter though. So you watch out for me. I'm really sad. Gertie. Gonna keep to Gertie. Bye, Lavenza. I stand here to say goodbye to the shadow that you have become. You were the best part of this game by far. Peace. Alright, let's go home. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I got everyone. Hey, um, I actually have a present for you, too. Oh. Huh. Aw. Even when I was human, I kept holding on to this for some reason. Between a cat, a human, or some kind of vehicle. It's been hard to say for sure who or what I am. But whatever else I am, I can say without a doubt. I'm your partner. Well then, we should probably go home and get packed, huh? You finished saying your goodbyes? Well, how'd it go? Did it make you feel like you want to stay? Yeah. I see. You must have made a lot of good memories here. You're leaving early tomorrow from Shibuya, right? Make sure you pack up before you head to sleep. Oh, and take that stupid cat with you. I don't want her getting lost and ending up back here. Don't make fun of me. I can go wherever I want all by myself. Huh. It really never stops meowing, huh? Hey, Futaba, what's he saying? Is he sad that he has to leave me? He said, Sojiro stupid. <laughs> what? What kind of translation is that? Let me have a nice goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Mona's your responsibility now. Leave Sojiro to me. All right, I've been counted on. Aww. Oh, man. Even if you're not here, I'll make sure I do my best. So, you go do your best, too. I will. Thank you for everything. It's been a good run. Hey. Hey. You got everything? I took you in. I thought I was the one helping you. But it turns out it was the other way around. Take care. Don't be so cheeky. Oh, sorry. I wanted to have Futaba see you off, too. I haven't been able to find her since this morning, though. Same with that cat. If you end up back in the city, come on by. I'll at least treat you to a nice cup of coffee. Thanks. Wait, that means I can't go closing the store, huh? <laughs> what are you doing? 
Hurry up and go. Yeah. I'm not crying, you're crying. <laughs> after we said hmm? we'd disband we are all in break after all no more entrance exams mm. I can drive you to the station you really really gotta go <gasps> shit <laughs> they've even followed us here what should we do need a hand hmm? Oh, go away. I'll <laughs> break Dr. your teeth Maruki? for real. You're suggesting uh -huh. we split up? <laughs> Should we? <sighs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no. Here we go! Come and get us! <laughs> <laughs> Shall we then? There's no charge. Oh. If you find yourself struggling in life, you can start over, like me. Remember that. So yeah, if that ends up saving you, then we're square. <laughs> Good luck. Whoa. Damn, man! Those dudes just wouldn't give up! Wish it went smoother, but hmm? I guess this is it. Be sure to eat well. <laughs> you we'll see you. Soon, right? Yeah. If you don't come back, we'll find you there. Hmm? All right, it's mm -hmm. time. Yeah. Aww, gotta go already? We don't make the train schedule. See you later, my dude! <laughs> And sit down. <sighs> the original ending was better. <sighs> you taught me to keep my head up, didn't you? Hi. <laughs> Told you I was coming with you. Oh, damn. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Take care. Huh? What was that mm, weak goodbye? the opinion that the original ending was better. But that's just me. <sighs> I... I really enjoyed
enjoyed this game. It really did. It was worth the time I put into it. It definitely took me a lot longer than I thought it was going to. But, you know... It's not a flawless game. It's got issues. You know my opinions of Sumire. And the third semester was fine, but it also could have been moved and I felt like it would have had more impact. But, you know, it's just me. game has taken over my life. I'm definitely going to do a new game plus run sometime. But
Who's texting me? Definitely gonna be some kind of sequel. Not like Scramble, but something else, I think. Hundred and fifty four hours. We did it. I I don't know what's next as far as like the secondary series goes. I'm working on setting up a computer for Persona Four. But if I don't get that set up in a reasonable amount of time, maybe Revelations Persona, like the one that comes on the PlayStation Classic. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. So yeah, that's, that's Persona 5. Definitely going to start a second playthrough because I want to do some of the optional stuff and I want to max out all the confidence and blah 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 blah. But now that i finished this game for fucking finally, I don't really need to worry about it too much, especially since I've got Nini next week. And that's alright, this video is coming out next year 2021 sometime i'll figure it out so yeah thanks for watching it's been like 180 parts sure let's say 180 i don't know 
But yeah, thanks for watching. Had a blast.